The car wash name is Bob's Car Wash. We, uh, my father-in-law's name is Bob, and we wanted to create an image around him because he's the one that works here. And so he builds relationships with the customers. Yeah, the Pawnee Group is actually an investment company that I own. And in 1994 and 95, we decided we wanted to find other investment opportunities. And so uh, we identified a couple of lines of businesses that we wanted to pursue. And Car Wash was on the uh, list near the top. So uh, we built uh, this car wash here. We've been operating the car wash now nearly six years. The uh, car wash is the busiest car wash in Northern Colorado. It does a significant amount of, of uh, both automatic and self-serve business. We have a friction wash, uh, soft gloss, and we have uh, an overhead touch-free and in four bays of self-service, six uh, vacuum fragrance shampoo kinds of arrangement. Car wash business can provide a great return on investment if the business is managed well. In this market, uh, investments have a pretty poor return on investment. I mean, if you look at banks, you probably are at a 1% return. And, and if you look at stocks, if you can get six or seven percent, it's pretty astounding. And you can do better than that here at the car wash. Rica was uh, on the top of our list of car wash manufacturers that we were interested in. We went out and uh, uh, tried hundreds of car washes in Colorado, took sample cars through the car washes to see uh, which ones we liked. We timed them to see how fast they could do washes. And uh, ultimately, we narrowed it down to RICO as the best solution for us. Uh, our service guy um, uh, from RICO is uh, spectacular. Uh, he is an asset for RICO. He's here when he says he'll be here. He knows the equipment inside out, and he can troubleshoot and solve a problem for us. Uh, he's also available to us via phone. So if there's something I feel that I can fix, but I'm not quite sure about, he'll give me some direction on how to proceed. So our maintenance guy is a real asset to our organization, and, uh, and therefore a real asset to RICO. It's just, it's one of those uh, make it, break it kind of uh, factors. And, and the maintenance guy is really important to us. The relationship with RICO is one of our critical success factors. We couldn't be successful without a great working relationship with RICO. Uh, I rely on RICO for our day-to-day -day functioning. If I lose a bay for a day, that's money lost. And so I have to have a great working relationship with RICO. I need them to be responsive to me. I need them to be a partner in my business. If I don't have that, I don't succeed. So it's, this, this really is a partnership. I know there are people who build car washes and uh, buy you know, some Joe's Backyard equipment and they do all their own maintenance. and. But I, I don't think you can really be successful as an investor doing that. I think you have to have a partnership and with a vendor who is always there, who's reliable and get the job done so that we can keep our bays up and running 24 by 7. So the Riker relationship is critical to our success.